Hey, Benny Bash, 12th of June, 2019. Came across this article that uh, raises some very interesting questions, in my opinion. Okay, they're telling us about Ebola ravaged Congo is now hit with 87,000 suspected measles cases. The dreaded measles. Okay. Now, my sense is there is some nefarious activity going on here, and that's just the way it is because this makes no sense whatsoever. They sit here and give you these dire statistics of how thousands of people are dying in the Congo from Ebola and measles now, okay? Very dire situation over there. They really hammer it home here how bad it is and tell us how there's an experimental Ebola vaccine developed by Merck, another loving entity. Okay, so they're telling us this, but the question is, at the same exact time they're telling us this, they are welcoming in hundreds, if not thousands, of migrants from Congo. And these people are coming in through the country unscreened, unchecked. They're getting a mere visual check to make sure that they're not dying on the spot. But these diseases can harbor themselves in the human and incubate for weeks on end before the symptoms actually appear. So they're having a dramatic rise in migrants, particularly from Congo. So why would they push this out of one side of their mouth, but at the same time, they're out there looking for French-speaking people to help. Do you understand what I'm saying? There's hundreds of these migrants being dropped in Texas. A dramatic rise. And yet, no word of it. No nothing. Because their measles issue that we've been witnessing in this country for the last several months screaming and hollering like it's the end of the world and if you don't get your children jabbed that they can't even go into public scaring the living daylights out of everybody for a disease that is non-fatal okay but now they're going to introduce the Ebola because you can't argue with that the measles wasn't enough of a problem they need some real disease going on that will be a sufficient problem so that the people will demand a solution from the same people who created the problem. There's your reaction. But luckily for us, right, Merck has a vaccine for that, just like the MMR. And there's your solution. We're from the government and we're here to help you. So this is the intent. This is the level of evil that you're dealing with. This is something you need to face. You need Jesus Christ in order to guide you through all this madness. Because their version of a silver lining is to hold you down and force poison into your body. Especially your children. Because that's the plan. Okay? So, I hope you know Christ because this world is getting darker by the minute, okay? So, peace and grace to each and every one of you. Seek Jesus. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God.